Continuing coverage of a unique legal battle erupting right now in Cameron County. Uh, today, county leaders file suit against their brand new sheriff. Here's Channel 5's Rudy Mereles. During Tuesday's commissioner's court meeting, the county's legal counsel requested permission from the court to file a lawsuit. To enforce the court's constitutional powers over budgetary and personnel issues and protect the integrity of the county civil service process. The motion passing unanimously. Motion by Commissioner Lopez, second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All opposed, motion carries. The suit filed this morning in state district courts alleges Sheriff Eric Garza moved 15 deputies to his department. Deputies assigned to court security that are budgeted and commissioned to Precinct 2 Constable Abel Gomez. Yesterday, Garza telling us the process he says was followed. First and foremost, we notified Commissioner's Court and the county judge. In a letter on March 25th, Garza notified county officials that he believed the agreement between the Sheriff's Office and Precinct 2 Constables to provide security was not legally binding. Well, by law, the Sheriff is in charge of courthouse security. Unfortunately, the previous administration was not taking care of that, uh, that uh, responsibility, so they made a contract with another law enforcement official. According to the lawsuit, the county's legal and HR teams asked Garza to rescind the letter to allow for legal and administrative processes to meet his request. The suit goes on to say Garza denied their request on March 29th. The same day deputies began working under his direction without allowing the commissioner's court and HR departments to follow the budgetary and legal transfer of positions. Today, a state district judge said the sheriff violated the Texas Constitution as well as Texas local government codes, issuing a restraining order halting the deputies from working for Garza until a hearing is held. This afternoon, Garza's chief deputy responding to the suit, saying the office will follow the order but saying the commissioner's court is trying to prevent Garza from doing his job. To state this as clear as possible, the Cameron County Civil Legal Division has sued their own client. This is without doubt a waste of your taxpayers' money. In Olmito, Rudy Mireles, Channel 5 News at 10.